Freeman Street, Grimsby, home of Freeman Street Market. Known by locals as the heart of Freeman Street, this market is still going strong and providing a service to the local community. Over this series, we take a look at the lives of some of the people who rely on the market to provide themselves with an income for themselves and their family. Although many still give it a bad name, I've got to ask you, when's the last time you give it a try? This is Freeman Street Market. Part-time jazz singer Shannon runs her own hair salon on the market. As you might expect, she offers her customers something a little bit different. I offer all sorts of hairstyling, from cuts, colours, even to hair extensions and vintage put-ups. What I enjoy about my job, especially, is putting hair up. For brides, for people going out on a night out, to balls, to proms, to um, just wanting to make themselves feel better. It just makes them feel great before they go out and um, it gives me a good name because they go and tell all the friends. For me, hairdressing isn't just a job, it's a social thing as well. People come here for a chat as well as getting their hair done. It's a day out, if you like, it's just something to make them feel good. And that's why I enjoy it. I always wanted to be self-employed, but I knew that I couldn't really just start out in a shop. It's so easy to fail just going straight for a shop. So I thought this was always a beginning plan, a little you know, step up to maybe having a shop. But I just found that it's so reasonable and it's so convenient for people. And like I say, because the rent's quite cheap, I can afford to, to have lower prices. So people will come to me in the end. I think what makes me different is I do a lot of vintage put-ups, a lot of um, people are into burlesque at the minute or sort of retro fairs or getting really into vintage hairstyles for the wedding and that's something that I really specialise in, that's kind of my niche and um, yeah I think that's what sort of makes me different to the rest at the moment. Different she might be, but what do her customers think? Yeah, I've been coming to the salon since it opened um, to have my hair pinned up by Shannon. Um, you know, she does something different for me every time for the countless times that I need my hair putting up just to make me feel pretty. Yeah, she's she's a, a well-experienced a hairdresser. She's um, She can do anything, pretty much anything you ask her. Shannon always looks after me and I'm really pleased with what she does. Um, she styles it lovely and she does the colours nice for me. It's not every day someone decides to set up their own hairdressing business. What made Shannon think about setting up on the market of all places? Business is great on the market. I have a lot of footfall, um, whereas I wouldn't necessarily have that on a street in a shop. You have a lot of people that come here especially um, to do the food shopping or whatever, and they wouldn't necessarily think of having the hair cut on the market, but they see me as they're passing by and they, and they come in. So It was really easy to get set up. I mean, it was a last minute decision. I was going to get a job somewhere else and I just thought, this is not for me. So I, it was kind of a last, last minute decision. I, I rang up the market and I said, have you got any stalls free? And they said, yes, come have a look. And I think it was like two weeks later I was here, set up. Good thing about me here, I think, is I am quite affordable for people, especially, especially the pensioners. You know, a lot of them, like I say, it's convenient for them and it's reasonable for them. And that's why I think they'll keep coming to me. For the time being, I will not want to move anywhere. At the minute, it's really convenient for me, convenient for the customers and I'm happy here. Shannon certainly is a happy hairdresser and who knew that you could have a short back and sides while doing your shopping. You see, supporting your local market can be a truly hair raising experience. In a good way of course. <laughs>